Hi, I'm Jean Panna Keithner, the Director of Sales at Thursby by Identiv. This is part three of our 12 part Sabrosa for iOS user guide series. In this video, we'll review some tips available in the app and talk about the card status icon. If you don't know what Sabrosa is, or if you're not sure which app to download, I recommend checking out the first video in this series. A link to that is available in the video description below. Let's get started. Sabrosa has a few gestures that you may notice by using the app. Scrolling down will cause the address bar and toolbar to scroll out of view. This is really helpful when you need to maximize the screen space. Scrolling back up will bring the toolbar back. If you do a long scroll upward, then you will see our tabs menu appear. You can browse through, close, and open tabs from this menu. When you're finished, another long scroll upward will make it go away. Sabrosa does a lot of work in the background to make your web browsing experience as quick and easy as possible. Ultimately though, you are still connecting to web servers that may be down or just moving slow with an internet connection that is never as fast as anyone would like. This can make it hard to tell if issues you are experiencing are due to the website, the internet, or if there's something wrong with the card reader. To help with this problem, we've created the card status icon. This icon can always be found in the top left of the Sabrosa app. No icon indicates that a reader is not connected or couldn't be found. When just this C is present, it means the card reader is ready, but no card has been inserted. When you insert the card, you will notice the icon switch through a couple of different status updates. Once the yellow check mark appears, it means the card reader is ready and the card has finished initializing. A green dot in the top corner then tells you that the card reader is ready and the card is ready to use. If you see this icon with a little power symbol at the front, then the card reader is ready but the card is powered off. It should power back up on its own the next time you are prompted for a certificate. If that doesn't happen, you may see one of two error icons. This icon tells you there was a problem initializing the reader. Or you may see this icon, which tells you there was a problem initializing the card, or the card is not supported. If you see these icons, we recommend that you try unplugging the reader, force quitting the app, and try again. If the problem persists, you can reach out to our support team by phone, email, or on live chat through our website. All of our readers come with a six month warranty and lifetime support. In the next video, we'll discuss the icons in the toolbar, including bookmarks and the QR code scanner. If you have questions about anything you saw in the video today, or if you would like more information on our products, please feel free to reach out to us by phone or email. We'd be happy to answer your questions. Thank you for your time today. I hope you found this video helpful.